First Energy has planted and donated more than 10,000 trees throughout its six state service territories since April. Today, they were at Buell Park. All right, the first news was there and has why planting these trees are so important for the park's future. More than 100 tree saplings that you see right behind me were planted today at Buell Park. Now, they will be used in the future to restore forested habitats within the park. Creates a good wildlife habitat uh, for our wildlife that live in and amongst the park. Um, we have um, numerous different species of birds that are, that are living in here, you know, anywhere between, you know, different species of owls to hawks and osprey. And All the trees planted today were hardwood trees because they will thrive and survive in Buell Park. This initiative is an important part of First Energy's efforts to further the advancement of sustainable practices. We all work and live within the communities that we serve, and so giving back to our communities and supporting our local environment is very important to us. Um, we have a mission to reduce our carbon footprint and also promote responsible use of natural resources, and this is just a great way to have some fun uh, while, while doing those things. The reforesting projects are so important to the park. Boise says this year alone they have taken out over 70 trees. The new trees will help replace those ones that have fallen over or needed to be taken out for hazard purposes. He says this goes along with the park's mission of keeping it free and keeping it alive. It's the exact intention that Frank and Julia Buell left behind. Um, community coming together, volunteering to keep it, keep something going um, that's been around for over 100 years. Now in three to five years, they will move the trees from the nursery to be replanted in their forever home throughout the park. In Hermitage, Taylor Long, WKBN 27 First News.